Morning guys and hope it's all well with you guys on day three of the lockdown. Thank you for everybody that subscribed to our channel and uh, remember to push that little notification button as over this period we will be loading a lot more content, putting some clips together, extra traces, extra demos and a whole bunch of extra things we can and send it through to you. Even some of our ambassadors are using their cell phones and making some additional clips, sharing some additional information with you guys on a daily basis. We'll probably get our update from uh, Jay soon, which we'll share with you guys. Well, as for going forward, um, I'm quite blessed. The people I'm sharing uh, my household with is really a pleasure. So there's no way I'm worried about the next couple of days coming or the time I have to spend here at home. Um, and then obviously keeping ourselves busy. Now the extra content we're gonna do for you guys, like I said, the first two days, a bit of cleanup. So I'm gonna go to the tackle room just now, a garage, but it's never been used as a garage. It's our tackle room. And uh, we're gonna start there and run through things. And I want you guys to, to uh, interact, put comments there of what you would like us to see, do, and uh, maybe traces and baits you would like to see. And then guys, obviously I'm sure a lot of you have got some bait in the freezers. Um, every now and then we're going to take some of that bait and show you how to cook it. If you don't have your own uh, recipes yet, or maybe there's something new you can see, maybe we can share something valuable in that. And then obviously all the traces on the deep sea side, on the bass side, rock and surf. And we've also got some of our freshwater guys that's going to prepare some clips uh, for us and send it through. So make sure you're subscribed and make sure you, you push that little notification button and just select all. And you'll get all the notifications. You can choose which ones you do want to watch. So guys, yes, another 19 days. Let's make the best of it and let's put as much fishing content and fishing topics out there as what we possibly can. So yeah, I'm looking forward to, to sharing as much. A lot of times we're in routine, we're doing all these things and you always think of so many things you still want to share with the public and, and clips you want to do, but we never get to them. There's always an excuse or two. Now there's not no real excuses except for the fishing side. And like Jay said yesterday, a big up to and well done to all anglers adhering to the lockdown. So far so good here in Natal. Obviously we can't see the whole coastline, but the part um, that uh, Jace is in charge of, so far so good. No anglers have slipped out and tried to, to catch some fish. Uh, I find myself here in a lovely estate with eight dams. And uh, yes, same for us, lockdown within your yard. Can't go to the dams, um, can't go for walks. The same as outside the estate as well. So guys, yeah, let's go look. Um, I even started a little veggie garden here. Um, just going forward, we may maybe get some really fresh vegetables without having to drive. Um, me and Caroline tried our best to make sure we've got here what we need, that we don't have to drive for any, uh, you know, unnecessary reasons. So, and uh, yeah, we all do our part. We try our best to, to bring the curve down and make sure we can uh, bring these days down that it doesn't end up being three or four months. So everybody out there, we do our part. Okay guys, let's make it up to the tackle room. Lovely day. Gee whiz. That is really such a nice day. And uh, I think a lot of you will agree for a Sunday. What a perfect day to go out to the beach with the family. <laughs> we do miss it. And a lot of times it's, uh, I think maybe a bit of a mental thing. Just the fact that you can't, you actually now want to do it even more. But yeah, tackle room, I had to, uh, the last two days, spend some time to just get it in an acceptable kind of condition to bring you guys in. Now, uh, as you can see, I've got a lot of stuff to still sort out. And uh, yeah, this is a little project I took on. Was hoping that maybe we can get access to the dams. And uh, so I've set that up, I've turned my, uh, my float tube into a kick boat, meaning now I'm out of the water, but which is nice when it gets cooler over winter, 
you don't freeze every part of your lower body. So a bit higher up and I'll run you guys through, I'll make a clip this week of how I did it. I took the route of using PVC pipes instead of aluminium. So yeah, just tackle room, set up the bass essentials, deep sea essentials, my hooks, floats, rock and surf stuff's all mixed up there. And then all the other McGafters. There's a whole bunch of stuff here. Um, bass baits on that side, lures, uh, rods. This is my stand-up rods. Another thing I'll, I'll maybe run you guys through is this stand. I put up a fence outside and there were some offcuts of the blue wood, some left. And uh, I took that and made a, a rod rack just for the stand-up rods, this deep sea stuff. Also acquired all the deep sea stuff just before lockdown to, as we're launching our deep sea side now, we got all the, ne the later stuff, later equipment. I'll run you guys through that and I'll prepare that for when the lockdown's over, as well as some of the bass stuff. And uh, yeah, a whole bunch of, lots of McGafters and little things I should actually be chucking out. Now every two years it's a cleanup project, getting rid of all the older tackle, uh, updating a tackle and putting new ones in. So guys, I've got a bit, a fair amount of uh, tackle here to be able to do demos and uh, clips on certain things. Also the bait freezers have still got a fair amount, they're half of, uh, full of bait, half full, never half empty. <coughs> and I don't think most of that bait probably won't use after lockdown or get fresh bait. But uh, certain parts of that will be cooked over the next two or three weeks and I'll show you guys. And then uh, also for bait demos. So in the comments today, let us know what you would like to see, traces, techniques, uh, spooling reels, knots, whatever you can think of. Put them in the comments and we'll try and do as many of those as what we possibly can. Um, like I said, there's a fair amount of tackle that I can use to make some traces. Uh, so if you request something really that I can't do, we'll just, uh, we'll just let you know about that if it's not possible. But yeah, looking forward to seeing the comments and seeing what you guys would like to see. Just have a great third day of the lockdown, if that's possible, and really enjoy the time with your families. Make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that little notification button so you guys can see each video that gets uploaded and be notified.